1050. Uh, here we go. Two entire chapters. The long haul. Okay, Hezekiah celebrates the Passover. Hezekiah sent word to all Israel and Judah and also wrote letters to Ephraim and Manasseh inviting them to come to the temple of the Lord in Jerusalem. Why is this the tribe of Joseph? Oh, who knows? To the Lord God, the God of Israel, the king and his officials, and the whole assembly in Judah, in Jerusalem, decide to celebrate the Passover in the second month. They had not been able to celebrate it at it at the regular time because none of the priests had been consec had consecrated themselves, and the people had not assembled in Jerusalem. The plan seemed right both. To the king and to the whole assembly, they decided to send a proclamation throughout Israel from Beersheba, B-E-E-R-S-H-E-B-A, to Dan, D-A-N, or is Manhasset and Ephraim, just what we're calling the Norse tribes now. The South tribes are Judah. Calling the people to come to Jerusalem and celebrate the Passover to the Lord, the God of Israel, just because we don't have this letter today, we doesn't mean it doesn't exist. We probably have a lot of letters that don't ex that don't physically exist anymore. Doesn't mean they never did. It had not been celebrated in large numbers, according to what was written. How long? It doesn't say. At the king's command, countries went through Israel. No cultures or something in Judah with letters from the king and from his officials which read people of Israel return to the Lord the God of Abraham Isaac and Israel that he may return you to who are left who have escaped from the hand of the king of Assyria Oh yeah, that. Do not be like your parents and follow and fellow Israelites who are unfaithful to the Lord, their, the God of their ancestors, so that he made them as an object of horror, as you see. Do not be stiff-necked as your ancestors were. Submit to the God... No, submit to the Lord. Come to his sanctuary, which he has consecrated forever. <laughs> Service. The, serve the Lord your God, so that his fierce anger will turn away from you. And no, if you return to the Lord, then your fellow Israelites and your young children will be shown compassion by the <coughs> by their carpenters and will return to this land for the Lord your God is gracious and compassionate he will not turn his face from you if you will return to him The Corniers went from town to town in Ephraim and Manasseh as far as Zebulun, C E B U L A U N, M N, yeah. But people scorned and ridiculed them. Nevertheless, some of Asher, A S H E R, Man. Asa and Zebulun, C E B U L U N, humbled themselves and went to Jerusalem. Also in Judah, the hand of God was on the people to give them early 
give them unity of mind to carry out what the king and officials had ordered, following the word of the Lord. A very large crowd of people assembled in Jerusalem to celebrate the festival of unleavened bread in the second month. They removed the altars of the altars in Jerusalem and cleared the way. The uh, increased altars and threw them into the Kidron Valley. I don't know if I spell it for you. This time. They slaughtered the Passover lamb on the 14th day of the second month. The priests and the Levites were ashamed and consecrated, no, ashamed and consecrated themselves and brought burnt offerings to the temple of the Lord. Then they took up their regular positions as prescribed in the law of Moses man of God the priest splashed against the altar of blood a hundred and two times by the Levites I think that's the wrong two translators overwrote this down since many in the crowd had not consecrated themselves, the Levites had to kill the Passover lamb for all those who were not ceremoniously clean and could not consecrate the lam their lambs or consecrate themselves. Oh, don't worry. Soon a lamb will come. And he will consecrate everyone. To the Lord... Although most of the many people who what, people who came to Ephraim and Manasseh, it's the chart I S H H C H E R Zebulun had not purified themselves yet. They ate Passover contrary to what was written. But Isaac and I have prayed for them. May the Lord, who is good, pardon everyone who sits on their heart, who is good, pardons everyone. What? Wait, what? I think I've read this all wrong. They looked, they took up their regular position, yeah. Many of them live at Kill the Passover lamb. Can I consecrate their lambs? There's a no. Or consecrate themselves. Yet they pass over. But has can I have prayed? My Lord, who is good, pardon every one who sets their heart on seeking this, on seeking God. And Lord, the God of their ancestors, why is my pinky going to sleep? Even if they are not clean according to the rules of the sanctuary, <coughs> and the Lord heard Hezekiah and the her healed the people. The Levites who were presented in Jerusalem celebrated the festival of unleavened bread with seven days with great rejoicing. All 
while the Levites and priests praise the Lord each day by with resounding instruments and decorated to the Lord. Okay. Or priests sang to the Lord every day, accomplished by the Lord's instrument palace. Hezekiah spoke encouragingly to all the Levites who showed good understanding of the service of the Lord. For seven days they ate their assigned provisions and offered fellowship offerings and praised or conf or and confused their sins to or confessed their sins to the Lord, the God of their ancestors. The whole assembly then agreed to celebrate the festival seven more days, so another seven days they celebrated Jolly Fish. Jolly Foley. Zechaniah of Judah provided a thousand bulls and seven thousand sheep and goats for the assembly. And the officials provided them with a thousand bulls and ten thousand sheep and goats. A great number of priests consecrated themselves. The entire assembly of Judah rejoiced, along with the priests and the Levites, who had all and all who who had ascribed from Israel, including the roy including the foreigners who had come from Israel and also those who reside in Judah. There was a there was great joy in Jerusalem for since that day Solomon, son of David, king of Israel, there had not been nothing like this in Jerusalem. The priests and the Levites stood to bless the people, and God heard them, for their prayer reached heaven, his holy dwelling place, when all this had ended. The Israelites who were there went out to the towns of Judah, smashed the sacred stones, and cut down the Asher poles. They destroyed the high places and the altars throughout Judah and Benjamin and Ephraim and in Ephraim and Manasseh. After they had destroyed the mall, the Israelites returned to their own towns and their own property. Oh yeah, if your hand's already falling asleep, just like open and close it. Oh, wait a second. That was it. I thought that was longer. Okay. Oh, it keeps charging again! Just took out the charger!